Hey guys, it's Tanya here. Thanks for watching. So today I have a little black bag haul for you guys. And if you watched my last LBB video, you would know that I talked about the um, Dynamo purse that I gifted because I wasn't sure that I was going to like the color. And then of course after watching Amanda's video, I realized I loved the color and had to like reship it to myself right away. So I'm going to talk about that first. So this is the Olivia and Joy Fuchsia Dynamo, and it really is this most beautiful, like, raspberry color. It, it really is a true fuchsia. It's a beautiful purpley pink color. It has gold um, hardware all over it, really nice detailing. I absolutely love the detailing on this bag. I think the hardware is really pretty. And then as far as functionality goes, you have this really cute kind of smaller pocket in the front, but it's actually really deep. This is something not a lot of people have talked about is how deep this pocket is. And like, let me just show you, that's an iPhone 5. So that's all the way to the bottom and you can barely see it sticking up on the top. So that's actually a very deep front pocket. And then you have two side pockets. So you have one on this side and one on this side. And again, really deep like that completely covers the iPhone 5. There is a back zippered pocket. I have stuff in mine. I have been using this purse since the day I got it so there is stuff kind of in mine already. And then you have two options for carrying this bag. You have the double handle here or you have this kind of shoulder strap. Of course it doesn't make it very long and this is not um, expandable or like movable so this is just as long as it is. But I really do like both options for carrying it, depending on how I'm feeling and what else I'm carrying. I do use the two different options. Now on the inside of this bag, you have the Olivia and Joy liner and their um, company logo. You have an inside zipper pouch, and then you have two um, pockets on the other side. And it is quite a deep bag, and actually fairly large, I would say. But again, I like that it's not completely structured, so it will bend and move based on what I put in it. So yeah, it'll bend and move based on what I put in it. So I really like that about this bag. I think you could wear this bag in all seasons. Originally, I thought it was more of like a spring summer bag because it was so bright. But after getting it, it's actually not that bright. It's a very nice kind of like muted fuchsia color. So I think you could wear this in the fall and possibly even into the winter. So this is the Dynamo and I am in love with it. Amanda, we're twinsies. <laughs> And the suggested retail on the Olivia and Joy Dynamo is $92, just that's the tag that came on it. So I think people really need to know that because for $49.95 you're getting an amazing deal. You're getting high-end purses, you're getting high-end accessories, and if you play your cards right you can actually walk away with a purse worth way more than what you're actually paying for it, which is a great deal. So on that note, I want to talk about the green cell phone cases. They finally came out with cell phone cases for the iPhone 5. These are worth $25 each retail value. I got two of them. I got the orange and pink, which is really cute. And you can see how well it fits the phone, and it's orange all the way around. The only gripe I have about this is I have, an, um, I have a car charger for my iPhone 5 with the old charger and then I just put an adapter on it and the adapter doesn't fit in here because of the way this is boxed off. If this was all open it would fit. Because it's boxed off it doesn't fit so I have to find a way to get around that. It works on my regular charger fine because it's just small and it fits in but on the, the adapter one it's kind of like a square box with a little piece sticking out of the top. So I don't know how I'm going to get around that right now but that's what it looks like. So that's the orange and pink. And then I also got the pink and green and this is exactly the same as the other one. Same buttons. Same style, and it's got the pink and green polka dots on the back. So cute. I'm like in love with this. Like, I just adore this. Another little added trinket before I get on to the jewelry was the gingerbread toffee bar. This is the chocolate bars they had. They had like a peppermint, a gingerbread toffee, and another flavor. I forget what it is. But anyway, we got the gingerbread toffee. This has already been eaten. Marcel got into this, and it was gone just as soon as it came in. He said it was really good. I don't eat dark chocolate. I know it's really bad because I should because it's actually very good for you, but I just don't like the way it tastes. So he ate this, he said it was really yummy. He said the chocolate was really smooth and really flavorful, but I can't tell you guys what I think because I didn't have any. All right guys, it's jewelry time. So I am wearing both of the jewelry pieces I got in this month's little black bag. This was the rain bracelet, and I forget what it's called, but it was the it's the green beads with the gold on the inside and then the gold kind of plate over here. It's just a stretch bracelet. It fits really nice on my wrist, and I do have not, I would say, I would say I have medium-sized wrists, 
but I really like this. I think it's actually very classy. I looked very cheap on the site to me and I was like, oh, whatever, I ended up with it. But when I have it in person, it actually looks really pretty on. And then the next one, I can't even remember who this is by. Sorry guys. I normally keep all my tags. This time I didn't. Um, I know that's just horrible. I'm sorry. Anyway, it's just a really pretty silver bracelet. It's one of those clip tops, so it clips open and you can just kind of slide it on clip it closed. This one's a little bit bigger. I don't know if I really like that. I mean, it doesn't go too far down, which is nice, but I prefer things to stay kind of higher up on my arm. So anyway, either way, it's really pretty, really shiny, very bling bling. And actually, it's one of the, I don't get a lot of jewelry from the little backpack that it doesn't come broken or isn't what I thought it was going to be. So it's really nice to get two pieces of jewelry from LBB that I'm just like, oh, I like both of these. I can keep them both. Last but not least, I think was probably one of the most coveted items on LBB this month. This is the Betsy Johnson wallet. And I was online at 9.59 waiting for this to release. This was the one thing I really, really wanted. And once it was in my bag, I just refused to let it go. It has the most beautiful print. It has sequins all over it. The Betsy Johnson nameplate. And then when you open it up, now remember that I have all my stuff in here already. Okay, so I took out anything I don't want you guys to see. Money, checks, driver's license, that kind of stuff. This is what it looks like on the inside. So it has card holders here, and then you have a middle zipper pouch here, which I don't use because I actually don't carry change in here. I have a change pouch for that. And then you have like a little slot here, another little slot on this side, and then more card holders, and then this part here for your money. And this back piece pulls out too. So I mean you have tons of compartments in here, which I think is really cool. And it zips up and it's like a really nice tight wallet. I think this is so pretty. It'll go with almost everything. Can't say enough how much I'm loving this wallet. So that's it for this little black bag, guys. Show you guys everything that I got. I hope this helps you guys. I hope you guys enjoy these videos. Coming up next is going to be a Tarte video with a Tarte giveaway. And I'm really excited about that. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and have a great day. Bye.